high drive to right. Takes a three. Touchdown, 49ers. Curry! What's up, Bay Area? It's your boy, Drew, from the Audible. Catch me, Rudy Ortiz, and Kevin Franz in every single weekday morning starting at 6 on KMBR 1050. Raider Nation, want to talk to you today. I'm part of the nation. I've been growing, growing up watching the Raiders my entire life. Very excited about what's happening this year. But just hold on one second. I don't want to be negative talking about this team. But you look at the AFC West, it's pretty crowded, isn't it? Three teams in that division with seven wins. The Denver Broncos literally stopped blocked the Saints from getting their fifth win last week, and the Kansas City Chiefs had a fantastic comeback win over the Carolina Panthers, and that's where I want Raider Nation to focus. I know Derek Carr is having a fantastic year, and the Raiders have a very promising outlook looking forward as we hit week 11, Raiders and Texans Monday night in Mexico. It's great, but the Kansas City Chiefs, winners of their last five in a row, are starting to heat up, and they're really making their impact on that division. So as we move forward, just watch the Kansas City Chiefs, and as they continue to roll on to the AFC West, maybe it's not the Denver Broncos that the Raiders should be worried about. It's the Kansas City Chiefs. We will have all the Raiders coverage all year long as we head into the NFL. Catch me and my boys on the Audible every weekday morning at 6 on KMBR 1050, the sports leader.